Guys, it's working. We are sailing right now. We've got wind in our plastic drop cloth. Antonio is kind of, I don't know what your job is. He's the ballast and, uh, and making sure that we, we don't fall over. Our, our lee boards are doing their job. Look at that, look at that. Woo, all right, there comes the breeze. Okay, so I'm gonna steer a little bit more into, there you go, upwind. There we go, so we lost a little, we didn't want to overpower yet. We're just getting used to it, okay. So now I'm gonna go off wind just a tad. Oh, there we go, there we go. Keep leaning, keep leaning. Ha ha, it's working. Uh, I'm just trying to film and steer at the same time, which is difficult. Probably I should put down the camera so we don't fall in the water. But so far, oh man, this is awesome. We're on the Potomac sailing our canoe. Nice job, Antonio. I did not think this was gonna work. Well, actually I had 50-50, I guess. I had a higher hopes than you did. So we're, the wind is pretty strong. Uh, it's a steady breeze. And so the sail is filling up nicely it the shape is not perfect you can see it at the front over here oh yeah you were right about the pulley system that on uh, the green line is kind of Intriguing. making our sail a little smaller really because that front of it isn't working we'll have to think about how to re-rig that oh sorry i'm starting to steer too much into the wind all right oh yeah look at that oh so that's our plastic drop cloth we have what five grommets in it and they're just tied to our conduit pole there which is hoisted up with our tripod. And we have our dagger boards on the sides, which are just, they're not even mounted really. They're just um, twisted on with some, some sticks to help twist up the, the bank line. We have our cam cleats here. These are really important well, because this oh, makes we're it- We're pretty far out. Oh yeah, we should go back, shouldn't we? Okay, we're so back. we're gonna tack. We're gonna go upwind. And by the way, because of our sail shape um, and the way we're doing this, it's a really simple yeah, design. We're, we're just, I just have my rudder to move. Oh, there goes the sail. And uh, we're not even adjusting the front point. I think that's called the, the tack, the tack of the sail, the front corner. We're not even adjusting that. We are only really moving the rudder right now. So once we get over a little bit more, we'll pick up. Oh, look at the sun. Oh, Antonio, we did it. Now we're going back. All right, so here's a, a view from the front. We have our rigging set up here. We really don't need to move a lot of it at all. The green line is simply here to hoist up the main. We have it rigged up with a bunch of pulleys just to keep it out of our way to run it along the edge of the boat. And then the, the small line here, that is actually rigged up here. Oops. And then it goes all the way back to, to behind An Antonio there. And then to the, I think that's called the, the leech, the leech of the sail. So that is, that's how we're controlling the sail, moving it out or in. Let's see, I'm letting it go a little. Well, there's not a whole lot of wind right now, so it's not really moving out too much. And then I can pull it back from here. So everything is led aft the front back just pull this tight if you need to let it go if you need to but really we found that for what we're doing we just leave those in place so far and just use the rudder so between the rudder and the lee boards i mean this thing look at that you can see the water going past it it's actually working yeah we're moving this so particular the, canoe the, this is very very little wind and it's, it's moving us that's right. We had some big gusts when we first got here, but it's really died down now. So uh, it's very pleasant, actually. That's how efficient that sail is. It's really, it's really cool. Yeah, it's amazing how this piece of plastic drop cloth is, is really doing its job. Now, uh, this canoe is it's pretty heavy, and it's very wide-bottomed. It's not that long, so it's very stable. And I think that's something that adds to to why it's been successful. 
Um, if it was too narrow, we'd probably feel really wobbly and, and unsteady, but we're even right now just sitting on the seats rather than on the floor like we originally were because it feels steady enough. If the wind picked up, we'd probably drop down. The sail canoe works. Thanks. <laughs> 